Russell's troubled love life. How did he ruin Meg Ryan's family? My marriage was not working. Yeah. I think you know, things are going really badly for me. Did he cheat on his girlfriend with a younger girl? This stuff's true, mate. This stuff mm. is going on. He was depressed and had anger issues. Sometimes, Jamal, I just blow up. I think it's unhealthy to bottle stuff up. His career was going downhill. To being a kind of outsider in Hollywood. Having a kind of a hard time lately. Labelled as a homewrecker, his own relationship failed. I didn't leave my marriage for Russell Crowe. Do you believe in love at first sight? Yeah. Getting to this point with the divorce, and no matter how amicable a split is, you've still got to unwind things at a very deep level. Does he have a hard time accepting he's not a heartthrob anymore? In the year 2000, Crowe was in the middle of a huge scandal. Russell was blamed for Meg Ryan and Dennis Quaid's failed marriage. He wasn't a homewrecker. He took a lot of heat for that. And he had a lot of grace, frankly, about not talking about things that he knew were going on in my marriage. And I didn't leave my marriage for Russell Crowe. My marriage was not working. Yeah. But Meg wasn't ready for another marriage, and they separated. Meg is a beautiful and courageous woman. I grieve the loss of her companionship, but I haven't lost her friendship. In 2003, he tied the knot with the love of his life Danielle Spencer. Russell finally seemed to have it all. I've been very lucky, you know. I've got two beautiful kids. I've, you know, married a, a beautiful woman, and uh, you know, I've had some success in my life. We have kids together. We've been friends since we've been teenagers. We've been in and out of each other's lives for a very long time. But after nine years of marriage, they split. It was a very painful period for both of them. I've loved Danielle Spencer since 1989, and that's never going to change. That's one of those things where I stare at her and go, how did this fail? I still can't work it out, because my feelings for her have never changed. Russell had a trail of unfortunate events. Breakups, bad press, losing Hollywood success. Being a kind of outsider in Hollywood. Having a kind of a hard time lately. Sometimes, Jamal, I just blow up. I think it's unhealthy to bottle stuff up. He was linked to many women, but none were serious. It was rumored that he was dating Terry Irwin. They were always very good friends. He was the first one to call after Steve Irwin died, and people believed there was more than that. Russell makes such a public song and dance about Terry and the kids, always tweeting about them, donating money, and visiting their Australia Zoo. And then there's their private friendship, it's no wonder half the world thinks they're an item. And if this is true, he just broke her heart. Just when she thinks things are going great, she gets blindsided by a headline of him wrapped around some much younger woman like Britney. This is the first instance of him going public after Danielle. So, who is this woman? Britney Theriot starred with Russell in Broken City in 2013. She since became a real estate agent. She is 26 years younger than Crow. They were first seen together playing tennis. Crow is a huge fan of the sport, and that might be how they bonded. Many fans pointed out Britney's resemblance to his ex-wife. Neither Crow nor Theriot commented on their relationships, but their kisses speak volumes. It's not known if Crow's relationship with Terry Irwin is ruined, but none of them have commented about this either. Russell likes to keep his personal life private. So we might never know what really happened. But Crow and Theriot might go public soon.